Okay, YouTube family, they've been catching suspects like Skittles on rice on the floor. I know it don't make sense. It don't make no sense, man. But we know Straight Drop allegedly wasn't the only one because it's too much of a master plan. But it's been a lot going on and, and you've seen how they're catching up with the situation. And as far as dudes getting dropped, dudes being snitched on, a whole lot of the on and ons. And, and now you've seen what this thing came to. What I'm hearing now is that one and a half million dollars educational purpose hit. Now, everything is allegedly, we don't want nobody to get in trouble, but that hit is about to drop more of the ops. Man, just pay attention to the rest of the video and you'll understand what we're going with this. And it is what it is out here in these Memphis oh, streets. Hey, let's go check out all that. And then even other people allegedly have died too. Now, with Young Dog's situation though, you gotta look at it this way. They took $500,000, which already was a lot of money for a murder. Can we get that part out the way? $500,000 to find who did it. Well, now the bounty has been upped to over a million dollars. Sheesh. Now, if you don't know, I'm about to get my DJ academics on minus the snitching. You dig what I'm saying? Now, rest in peace to the king rapper that he was, Young Dolph is what they call him. You dig what I'm saying? Hey, I'm going to let him play before I talk about the killers. Well, let me talk about the killers first. If you don't know, Young Dolph killers allegedly was caught. One of them, another one got killed. But then me being from the block in the streets, Ain't no way it's just two folks involved, bro. This guy, this is a thing, bro. You got a lot of generals in here, bro. You got a lot of names, a lot of people involvement. So a lot of people gonna get dropped. And a lot of people who love Dolph already understood this. Niggas already know this man was loved. So folks is gonna cooperate. So what they did, they dropped a bag for five hundred thousand dollars. You don't drop that much money for one shooter, two shooters, three shooters, four shooters, even together. You don't drop that much bad because you know somebody gave the contract kill. Somebody gave these hitmen, these steppers, whatever you want to call them. They gave them a, a, a bag bag. So the, the loved ones of Dolph is going to give a bigger bag to get this man murder solved the right way. And I think a lot of people too stupid to peep game on that. And Dolph legacy is going to keep living with that bag because you know people going to get a drop. People's going to snitch. But when they up it to a million dollars, now they upped it to a million dollar bounties way after the killer, one of the alleged killers being killed, way after cars being found out. That means people know, people know this is deeper than rap. It's deeper than two shooters or alleged nigga by the name of Jojo Splat and what's the other cuz they trying to blame on um, straight drop? Nah, bro, it's bigger than what you think it is, bro. This is Memphis. You hear me? This is Memphis. Now, when they did that, the doll it already was creep, right? We already seen the creepness, but a a a, a million dollar bounties, your own mom about to get the drop on you. Can we just say that a million dollar bounty, your own mom about to get the drop? This jewelry, these cars, this money is gonna be passed around and switch swapped through hands and everybody, all my folks and whatever they do with it. But uh, when I die, like when my kids ask who is their daddy, mm -hmm. like I'm still gonna be their daddy. Like yeah. that's the only thing that I can literally say is mine when I leave. You know what I mean? So yeah, I take that dead serious. But I like being by myself. Like I like peace. And hey, listen, folks. I don't mean to interrupt your video, but I need y'all to hit that like button, hit that notification bell, and smash that subscribe button. It's important to hit the notification bell. That's the way you support. It's who is they daddy? Mm -hmm. Like I'm still gonna be their daddy. Like that's yeah. the only thing that I can literally say is mine when I leave. You know what I mean? So. Yeah, I take that dead serious. But I like being by myself. Mm. Like, I like peace and quiet. I like... It's like I'm a loner, bro. I like... I do better and come up with better and I make money and do a lot. I do everything better, bro, just being by myself. Mm. You know what I mean? Like... 
kind of like a problem. Like, I hate that. Like, bro, why you by yourself? Why you by yourself? Like, I just don't like being with a lot of. I don't like being around a lot of people. Hey, what's popping? It's the kid. It's Dolph. As you all know, tonight me and my brother Key Glock, we dropping a new tape tonight. Dumber Dumber, Part Two. Yeah, it's dropping tonight at midnight. And if you all know me, you've been keeping up. I just gave away my Venador Lamborghini to one of my lucky fans a couple months ago. So what I wanted to do this time, I wanted to do something different. I got to do something different and I got to do something for my fans, something special. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to give away 100000 I'm going to break the 100000 down to fours. I'm going to give away $25,000 each week for four weeks. Tonight, the first, very, very first winner, I want you to tell me at midnight tonight, what is the 10,888th word that is said on the tape, Dumb and Dumber 2? What is the 10,888th word on Dumb and Dumber 2 tonight, midnight, $25,000? Who's going to be the first winner? It's down! I seen young Dolph moments before he was killed. But yeah, I definitely try to stay in the loop and see, um, you know, where they are in the case. While NPD hasn't confirmed any of the tips being passed around on social media, they say investigators are looking into them. Community activist Stevie Moore hopes this trend of supporting law enforcement with criminal investigations continues well beyond this case. Case tonight, police are still searching for those responsible for the death of the Memphis rapper. Police have received a number of tips and it's this level of community engagement that could be the difference in solving this case. The very G's Jordan James shares why fans say they're beginning to feel optimistic. As this makeshift memorial grows by the day, so does the anticipation to find the killers of young Dolph. Somebody, please come and talk. Let us know why this young man died in vain. Surveillance footage outside of Makita's captures the gunman Start and the, the getaway vehicle. Two victims were gunned down Since overnight into the early morning hours. Thanks for joining us. I'm Janae Lewis. One of the deadly shootings happened just hundreds of feet from where Memphis rapper Young Dolph was shot and killed on Wednesday. Very G. Sharita Patterson has reaction from neighbors who say it will take a community collaboration to end this epidemic of crime. Homicides are going up. Overnight, Memphis police responded to two deadly attacks. Strangely enough, in one case, where the shooting happened is part of the murder mystery. Early Saturday morning, detectives were called here to Methodist North after a man was dropped off. Unfortunately, the victim did not survive, leaving investigators with plenty of questions, again, to include where the attack happened, along with who was responsible. Hours earlier, minutes before midnight, Memphis police were called to yet another deadly shooting. This one in the 2300 block of Ketchum Road, just off Airways Boulevard, and right around the corner from where rapper Young Goff was shot and killed Wednesday. It's an area Chalmers Alcorn knows well, considering he has lived in the neighborhood over the past 31 years. Pretty good. Pretty quiet. He has seen and heard a lot in his 90 years, he says. Sadly, his sense of safety has been shattered at times. The young people, they out of hand. They out of hand. I don't know what about them. I just want to try to live myself. Despite these mounted surveillance cameras overlooking the area where police say the deadly catch them. Look, this series we've been doing on the Young Dolph updates has been real cool. Vibing with y'all, trying to, you know, do it for the streets. We ain't trying to get nobody arrested in trouble. That's not my job. I ain't 12. I'm here to be the hood journalist, DJ Bless One. You feel me? I need y'all to support by hitting the like button and thank you for watching this video. If the bounty is true, then things is going to get more hectic out here. All I could say is it ain't going to be good for nobody to be out here in these streets of Memphis if you're seeing your affiliate with people who might have put hands on dog look man these folks is out here the wolf is trying to eat man you know the goons is really gonna live up to their name because of who Dolph was man look man man is highly respected the yada and left his kids fatherless out here look I'm your guy DJ bless one love your family love your kids stay blessed gangster <laughs>
Oh, 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 oh,